morning, everyone. Welcome to another day in paradise. Mindy, this is paradise. And let me tell you, it is so your beauty amazing. is matching the flowers just behind well, you here. You know. Oh my gosh. And guys, behind that is the largest freshwater pool in all of the Caribbean. And when I say it, I mean it. It's one of the biggest swimming pools I've ever seen in my entire life. Yes, <laughs> not only do they have the largest pool, they have beaches surrounding us. We did the thrill park yesterday, if you guys want to see that. God, are you kidding me, dude? Ah! Oh, yeah! I hate you. Ah! Video it yesterday. was incredible. It was like honestly, I've never done such amazing water slides ever. And I will say, truly terrifying. Though. Some of the best water slides I've ever been to. Definitely the best water park I've ever been to. And probably the coolest thing I can think of to do in the Caribbean. Like I said this a couple times. If I were to be a billionaire and I were to buy an island, that's probably what I would do with it. It was yeah. like my paradise. We're still on that same island. Water park, however, we're gonna stay away from today so we can enjoy some of the other things that they have here. So we've got beaches, we've got pools, we've got so many food options, swim up bars. Oh, I've already had a soft serve. I think that we need to get in some of those fun drinks here soon. We're gonna take the kids up to the bar now of course we're doing all non-alcoholic oh, drinks for us yeah. and the kids here all right we party hard enough as it is we don't need to add anything to that today is going to be an amazing day we brought all the sunblock we're staying safe we're having fun it's kids a are having a blast torture out here but in a so great way i'm absolutely loving the heat loving Woo! the sun soaking up every minute that we can because we're roughly halfway through the cruise i don't think we're even halfway through we're loving no, every second of this we're on day three like almost eight but we know that it will come to an end eventually we know that eventually we're going to go back to utah where oh, it's probably utah. snowing at this moment who knows but we're going to soak up some sun here show you everything else this island has to offer because there is so much so much and tonight shaking things up a little bit we are doing an early dinner time because we have a show to get to it is one of the most renowned shows on all the open water one sky one sky we've heard one from sky. people at our hotel they got off of this boat and said one sky is amazing I'm it's so excited. the one to see so we're gonna be checking that out tonight so an action-packed day make sure you guys are subscribed go down below hit that like button let YouTube know that you're loving these vacation vlogs the cruise vlogs we love sharing them with you and you guys if you're not on Instagram go on over and follow us there at This Is How We Begin. So much Michelle amazing stuff. and Daniel are crushing the photos and videos as well. Well, mad shout out to mom because she's crushing the reels, the posts. I mean, our vacation is still some of my favorite because there is so much real time action over there. Make sure you check it out, you guys. But right now, I say we get in this water. Let's go jump in. <laughs> Why did it take two people to do that? <laughs> did it take one in the beginning? High five! And to be fair, I didn't even go over. I fell over to be nice because I was so big you couldn't lift me. <laughs> nope. It's actually amazing. I went underneath his whole leg up and I was grabbing air. I mean water. Yeah. Hey man, high five. <laughs> he can't get him. <laughs> <laughs> nope. How is your hair not going under? It's just hair. It's just hair. Look here, look here. Where's your hair? Trying to get Ryler underwater. Come on, Daniel. I watch. I watch. He throws. demoralizing, humiliating. Any other word you can think of that makes it feel really old? But this guy, this guy's going down.
kidding me? Crew and I set off to do a little bit of exploring and boy, are we exploring. We are walking through like the actual jungle. It's a pathway. I don't know where it opens up, but it, I think it's gonna open up at a beach, the ocean somewhere. We were just at the I pool. Hear. You can definitely hear, wait, I also hear like animal sounds. Maybe that's just whistling from people, but we don't even know where this leads. We are literally walking through the jungle, bro. This is incredible. I can't believe how much this island has that we didn't see yesterday. Okay, here we go. I see people, so we know there's civilization around here. <laughs> Crew and I have been out doing some exploring and wouldn't you know it, we found more snack shacks <laughs> with funnel cakes, caramel, mozzarella sticks, juices. We found overwater bungalows, nature trails, basketball courts, pickleball courts, full sand volleyball courts. There <laughs> is so much going on here today, dude. That doesn't even include like the zip line, the kayaking, <laughs> jet ski tours. Gonna go back, sync up with the family again. We just wanna do a little bit of exploring while they're out laying out. Crew and I can't sit still as easily as the rest of the group. So we went on a little bit of a walk, did some exploring, but I'm ready, even though we're eating right now, to do a little swim up bar, maybe get like a fun pina colada or something like yes. that. A couple of snacks inside of the pool because that is a vibe. That sounds amazing. <laughs> Not gonna lie, after some ample search and discovery, we were Ferdinand and Magellan out there on this island. We actually got a little bit lost. So thankfully there are maps all along the way. And of course you always have the gigantic Thrill Park water tower to guide you as kind of like center or home base. And they have this enormous hot air balloon, which hasn't gone up on either day that we've been here. It's just been too windy for it. Which right now it feels kind of mild, but I'm sure they have to have near perfect conditions to send that thing up. So haven't had a chance to see that up and over the island, but they do have the zip lines going, water parks going full speed. Oh, and I found the pool, bro. We're back. Let's go. We made it. Another hack that we have found is that the funnel cakes only come with powdered sugar, but the brownie comes with caramel. So crew, what did we decide to do? Ask for extra caramel. So we asked for caramel on it. Crew's actually the one who took it up a level and right out of his mouth, didn't even hesitate, said, can I get extra caramel? I'm sure they're going extra. It doesn't come with any. And Crew's like, a little more please, thank you. Crew knows how to do it. Funnel cakes with caramel, mozzarella sticks are the bomb, snack shacks located all over the place. We stopped at probably three on our little nature walk that we did there. Mm -hmm. But we still gotta go get a fun bevy in the pool, the largest freshwater pool yeah. in all of the Caribbean. Awesome. Right? The kids have been having so much right. fun. Whoa. That's what I, I heard. Didn't know that. That's what I read. You read? I read sometimes. Books, books Jerry. Jerry. <laughs> books. So we wanted a way to memorialize what we are calling the actual perfect day perfect yesterday. Perfect day. So we just want something that says perfect day. Perfect day. I wanted to just say perfect day. So we're gonna look here and see what we can find. They have I'm so not many feeling things. hats. Is this dumb to look for a sweatshirt in the Caribbean? Like, is that even? Do you a know thing? what? It doesn't like, matter what time of year it is. I just want a sweatshirt because at the end of the day, I love to just like cozy up. So. And I know that I'll wear that the most. Okay. So that's why I'm, I'm kind of in like a sweatshirt zone. What I ideally want, I don't know if they're gonna have it, is that water park tower, the thrill uh, park in the background, and then it says perfect day across. That it. would be so. That's cool. what I'm on the hunt for. That was for. our favorite part of this whole island. This needs to say perfect day because it really was the perfect day. We have had about as much fun as we can have second day here on Coco Cay. You can see that the sun's starting to set. Yes. We're being called back to the ship in about an hour. We want to go back and have an earlier dinner. We need to get back really soon. But we have yet to go refresh ourselves with some nice cool <gasps> beverages Ooh. at the swim up bar here in the largest freshwater pool in all of the Caribbean. So it's only a good seven or eight football fields away, but we're going to swim up to that bar and we're going to refresh ourselves. Maybe get one for the road for the swim back to our yeah. stuff. But I think that's the way we finish things off here. I can't wait. Head back to get some dinner before tonight's show.
Maisie, you know the perfect way? Where are you? <laughs> to finish the perfect day, swim up and get a delicious tropical drink. What are you going to get, by the way? What are you going to get? Pina. You going to get pina colada? Yeah. I can't decide because we did pina coladas yesterday. When I went to Cabo with mom, we learned to shake it up a little bit because honestly, all we knew was pina colada. I don't really know much else about these fun drinks. So we got some other really fun stuff. <laughs> you can yeah, right back. Are you trying to find a way you can touch? <laughs> swim up bar going down. I think we got the full family behind us here. Big question is, what are we getting? <laughs> Send it. Yeet. Rexy Doodle wrapping up the perfect day number two. Two perfect days here at Coco Cay. I'm ready to set sail in the open water. Now tomorrow is an at sea day, Brex. Yeah. So tomorrow we get a chance to explore all that the ship has to offer. But Brexy Doodle, he didn't tell anybody this, but he started his day doing the water slides on the ship. He went out this morning with crew while we were still in bed. Actually, with mom's permission, mom was awake and said, go ahead, have some fun. The ship is empty because everyone gets off and goes over to the island. They went off and they had their run of the water slides this morning. So they did them, what, like three or four times without even uh, any like lines? Like seven and eight. <laughs> without even waiting in a line. Same thing with the uh, flow rider, all the Things. Now tomorrow gonna be a little more action packed. It's gonna be everybody still on board on the ship because it's an at sea day for everyone who is on the oasis of the seas. We're gonna be fighting some crowds, fighting some lines, but we're still gonna have a ton of fun and explore every inch of this ship because it is a huge, massive monstrosity out here in the ocean. Wow, look at this handsome photographer down here. Just getting the shot, whatever it takes. But getting back on board, ready for dinner, our first show. And guys, we're not even halfway through this cruise. Buckle up for a lot more fun. Yeah. Wrapping up our second perfect day. We're back on the cruise it was ship. was a perfect day. We went outside to go close the vlog and the lens immediately fogged up. It's so humid. We don't even realize that because we're in the middle of the ocean. You don't really realize that until you walk outside and you're like, oh yeah, no, it's a little yeah, bit moisture it, out here. We're gonna be getting more of that tomorrow because we're gonna be at sea all day doing all the fun things that this cruise ship has to offer. We haven't and even hit the water slides on board here. We haven't. And I didn't realize how much bigger this ship was than like other ones. Seeing it next to the Freedom of the Seas today, which we did the Freedom of the Seas. It was an amazing ship. And we, we thought that was time. huge. And I it, didn't realize how much bigger this would have was. fit on like the right half of this one so this one has got a lot it's to a see lot. a lot to do and we have two days to take advantage of that tomorrow's an at sea day we'll be in jamaica and then back at sea again I'm so, so excited. whatever we don't do tomorrow we will knock out the following at sea day we are loving every minute of this cruise and we hope you guys are we hope you've been enjoying being brought along on these adventures you guys are just incredible with your responses to everything mom's posting some crazy great stuff over there on insta so make sure you check it out and that will continue throughout this epic adventure here at sea we love you thank you so much for being here thanks for so much being a part of our family grateful for you we'll see you all tomorrow Good night, everybody. Bye.